All right, Joe, here it is. The uh, ghost pepper donut and the spider donut. Hello, mammals. Bob the Raptor here. And today I am with Joe. Hey, how y'all doing? And, um, hey, Joe. Yeah, Bob? Um, today is the day that Dunkin' Donuts is releasing their, their ghost pepper donut. Um, all right. And I take it you want to try this spicy, sweet monstrosity. Mm, yeah. All right. I, I'm going to be honest. I ain't too excited about this to begin with, but, you know, we do want to be relevant. So, um, whatever, go for it. Um, you know, it's a good thing I ain't hungry. Yep. All right. I will, um, I will go then. All right. Whatever. Take your time. You always do. Oh, be quiet, Joe. Hi, welcome to the Dunkin' Donuts. Want to get these today? Uh, yeah. I want to get a uh, a spider donut, and I want to get a um um. I, I want to get a ghost pepper donut. All right. What was the first donut that you said? Uh, the spider donut. We've run out of spider donuts. No spider donuts. And we have run out of ghost pepper donuts. Oh, we don't have ghost pepper donuts either? No, we've run out of both. Um, okay. Is that something you are going to have tomorrow, perhaps? Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, hi. Um, I, I want to get um, a ghost pepper donut and a spider donut. Anything else? Uh, no, that should do it. All right, thank you very much. All right, I am back. Bob, seriously, what the heck took so long? I, I had to go to two Dunkins to, like, find the prey. All right, well, you're super motivated. Um, I guess we should uh, get in there and have a look. Yep. All right, Joe, here it is. The, uh... Ghost pepper donut and the spider donut. Um, all right. I mean, this looks like a normal, like, like cherry donut. Yeah. And that, like, is like one of them munchkin things inside of a regular donut. But still, um, you know, it, since it don't have meat or cheese, I'm not a ton excited. But, um, let's, um, let's get to it. All right. All right. Well, let's try the spider one first. Okay. Mmm. Okay. I definitely appreciate the cream. It's just like a regular glazed donut. Um, with orange cream and a chocolate leg. And then a munchkin, you know, a chocolate munchkin. Um, that makes up the, uh, the body. Yeah, um, this ain't exciting to me, um, you know, um, I mean, it's good for what it is, it's about what I expect, so, um, yeah, I have to give this one a clause up, what do you think, Joe? Like I said, um, it ain't exciting. All right, what do you say, on to the ghost pepper one? I was afraid you were going to say that, Bob. Mm. Okay. Tastes like a cherry donut with sprinkles. I get strawberry. It's not spicy. No, I, I think I can work with this one. Again, if I cared about having a, you know, pink, fruity donut thing, which I don't, but, and again, it ain't bad. Hmm. Interesting. Yep. This is a fruity donut. I mean, 
tastes more like it's got like a little cinnamony aftertaste maybe but if you did not tell me this was ghost um i would not know and i i am i am actually kind of disappointed well are you gonna eat that um sweet monstrosity that um you know, at least in my eyes, don't have much redeeming quality in the, the fact that it's fried. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I will eat it. It, it is it is okay as a donut. But again, I am disappointed it is not, you know, it is not spicy. It is not challenging. It is not even really that interesting from a, a, a spicy thing. Like, you know, I, I do not think calling this ghost pepper because I think it might discourage mammals who might be interested in trying it like who are not necessarily into into um spicy things I'm thinking like um our friend uh Elaine the food reviewer or the Kelly memo from the trips who do not necessarily like spicy things um but I think you know that this was you know enjoyable you know but the the, the name might scare those mammals off and and to to someone like me who is like expecting a spicy treat, this is not that. Huh. Mmm. Well, at least the um chocolate munchkin is really good in the middle of the spider donut. I actually rather uh rather enjoy this one more than the um so-called ghost one and again it is just the marketing that killed this one um but the spider one is good i definitely prefer this one over the other one as well um but um like i said none of it's particularly exciting i certainly wouldn't order this again again nothing against duncan but like i don't do i don't do sweet things you know just for the purposes of this review yep So, Joe, final thoughts? Well, I don't think it's fair for me to render a verdict claws up or claws down. As uh, we said, even going into this, um, this ain't my kind of thing. Um, it was fine for what it was. Um, you know, it's kind of, um, kind of junk food, mostly. I mean, it, it's redeemable in the fact that it's fried. I mean, so... Fried is good, but, you know, I don't care about sweet, and I don't care about spicy, although, you know, so I'm just going to have to abstain. Fair enough. Um, as far as the spider donut, I'm going to give a clause up to that one. Um, I'm going to have to give a clause down to the ghost one, just because it does not taste like anything other than a strawberry donut. I mean, it tasted like maybe a strawberry cinnamon donut or something. I mean, had you called it that, I would have been like, ooh, you know, or like call it a red hot, you know, red hot strawberry uh, donut. But, you know, if you are going to invoke ghost, um, I, I think that is a very bad decision for a marketing memo, because as I said, um, you know, someone who does not like spicy you know, but might actually enjoy the actual item, um, will be scared off. And somebody who actually wants ghost pepper is going to be very, very, very disappointed. So, um, so yeah, those are, th those are my two metal circles on the subject. All right. So, um, anyway, if y'all like this video, then please like and subscribe. Yeah, and if you have a question or a comment or a place you'd like to see us go in the future, um, then let me know in the in the comments below. Yeah, Bob over here is the one who answers all the comments. Yeah, and also don't forget we have a live stream every uh, every uh, Thursday and Saturday at seven p.m. Eastern, and also. Um, we do live premiere um, our videos um, most days at 7 p.m. Eastern. So if you want to hang out and chat with us while a video is premiering, um, certainly um, you can do so. 
So, um, also, don't forget to check out our merch store. So, thank you all for watching, and have a great day.